Hey, so today we're gonna go over step-by-step -step on how to use Buffer. So Buffer is a social media management tool that allows you to schedule out your posts, post directly, you have a dashboard. Uh, if you have the paid version, you can see analytics. It's a great tool, uh, and I'm gonna basically explain and show you how to use it at, at a step-by-step -step basis. And it's pretty simple, pretty easy. They have actually a free version that allows you to uh, schedule about up to 30 posts and you get to have about three social media accounts there. So for a bunch of people, for quite a bit of businesses, that is more than enough. So let's dive right in right now. Buffer describes itself on its website as a simpler social media tools for authentic engagement. And it has the same idea, right? So you have the dashboards, you can schedule out your posts, you can post um, directly, just publish. Uh, you have these dashboards. So it's extremely similar, uh, even the free version and the paid version is pretty similar to what Hootsuite is. So the free version allows you about 30 scheduled posts and up to three accounts. Uh, now with the combination of using Hootsuite and Buffer, I actually really enjoy it because I've been just kind of <laughs> maximizing using those two free tools with my social media management. There are some extra accounts that I, that I have to work on. So the three that Hootsuite provides me, I decided to go with Buffer and give it a try. So yeah, let's dive right in. So right now I'm at buffer.com. This is what their home screen looks like. You can scroll down. This is where you get started. Uh, you have a 14 day free trial and so forth, right? And uh, by the way, I forgot to mention they do have analytics as well, like Hootsuite does so you can create reports, insights, and so forth. Now, since I already have an account, I'm just gonna switch my tab over. So what, normally what you would have to do is uh, get started now and then you just create your account from there. That's all you have to do. Then from there, after your, all the stuff is processed, you can log in later on here, or you can bookmark it like what I do right here. So yeah, right here, I, this is what the page would look like. So here's my queue. I have the analytics. Now, since I do have a, um, since it's the free version, um, I believe they don't, yeah, they don't give me that much. Uh, they won't give me that much analytics. Anyways, uh, for Buffer in this case, with this specific account, I don't really use it too much. I have used it some. So I'm just gonna kind of dive in and just show you what's going on here. So you have the queue, analytics settings. You have your analyze tab, which will take you right here. It'll take you to a buffer account page that you'll actually have to end up paying for. So this is where the 14 day free trial, $50 a month. And this is where all the insights and so forth happen. So that's that part obviously is not paid. Let's go back to publish real quick. Now, okay, okay, so you have my two accounts right here. I didn't decide to add the three, three accounts, but what I would normally do is you click connect account and you connect it. So in this case would be Facebook, but you can even go down here and you can go to account then preferences. Um, and, so, and so this is really straightforward. All you would have to do when you create the post, so you go for 15, then I'll just add my link. I'll do this and it will show you actually an auto populated image or a clickable social card. So when you uh, go to your social media platforms, the Facebook, the LinkedIn, the Twitter of the worlds, it will have this as a clickable social card. So when they click it, yes, it's an image, but it actually links back to this article, which I have here and what, um, what buffer does automatically, which, I do and I don't like, I already shorten it, so you can unshorten it right here, since I already to use Snipply. But it shortens your links automatically, so for in Hootsuite, you have to automatically do that, you have to do that manually. Buffer automatically does it for you. Now, another thing too, if you click this, it'll actually add, attach an image. You don't need to though, all you would have to do then is either can add it to the queue, you can schedule the post, share now would obviously share it right now, and schedule through the post. So I have London time, that's obviously not correct. That's, that's what I'm saying, I haven't really used this too much with this account, but here we go. So I can like change it, today is uh, Tuesday, but we'll do Wednesday, let's do Wednesday since it's London time, and you can, you do that, then you click schedule, then all you do is a scheduling right now. That's all you would have to do to schedule out a post. I'm actually gonna delete that post because I don't want it. Let's do confirm right there, there we go. Yeah, and I mean, they do have some prompts right here too. You can schedule your tweets. Uh, when we switch over to my Instagram, I can actually delete this one right here too, but you can react to the queue. Sometimes there are issues, like any any you know, any you know third-party software, there are some issues. 
Uh, so here you have scheduled posts. You have all these prompts for different times of the week. Now, I personally do like Hootsuite more. I like the layout a little bit better than this. Uh, they have past reminders. So they actually remind you uh, <laughs> actually through your mobile phone. Uh, when you know when to post, they actually now this is I believe would be with the paid version. I, I could be wrong, but I know stories. Uh, you know you can actually start posting stories from Buffer, which is cool. Hootsuite does not actually offer that uh, product. And yeah, that's basically it. You know, so the free version you really can only post schedule uh, directly from uh, Buffer. It's still great, especially if you have that social media calendar and you're utilizing some other social media management tools, definitely use Buffer. Uh, you know, if, I guess if you don't want to pay for both, or I mean, if you like the Buffer uh, look and feel versus Hootsuite, use that. Either or are excellent. These are both excellent, great social media management <laughs> social media management tools. Yeah, but yeah, that's basically it. You know, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. We're going to be doing more marketing videos like this, just how-to videos, going over digital marketing tools. And until next time, take care.